Three. This is WFAA News. Tonight, the tweets and comments are pouring in from across the country. Calls to reopen the investigation into the death of Sandra Bland, all because of this video. The demands are coming from civil rights leaders, politicians, even presidential candidates. Good evening, I'm Cynthia Seguirre. And I'm Chris Lawrence. We shared you that video for the first time last night. It comes from the cell phone Sandra Bland was holding when a state trooper pulled her over. And that 2015 arrest has been controversial from the start. You know, before our report aired last night, a lot of people didn't even know this video existed and our Teresa Woodard has been following the fallout today. Yeah, Izzy and Chris, that report we aired in partnership with the investigative network has led to demands today for the state of Texas to reopen the investigation into Sandra Bland's arrest and her death in the Waller County Jail. That death was ruled a suicide. Here now, a clip of the video that Bland recorded on her cell phone, video that was never publicly seen until last night. Get out of the car! And then you're gonna I will stop light me? you up. Get out! Wow! Now! Wow! wow. Get out of the car! Really for a failure to signal. You're doing all of this for Get a failure to signal. Get over there! Right, yeah. This yeah, led Texans Beto O'Rourke and Julian it. Castro, for both candidates for the Democratic signal. nomination for president, to say the investigation into this case right absolutely right needs to be reopened. Activists who marched in the days after Bland's death are echoing that message, demanding to know why this video never surfaced while the case was in court. A state rep from Houston, who is also a lawyer, said today that laying out all evidence that's deemed relevant, and she believes this video is, is the cornerstone of how the U.S criminal justice system is supposed to work. Saw on that video that the taser was pointed right in her face while she was in the car. I can't think of any circumstance that that would be appropriate. Um, an officer pointing the taser when she clearly just had her phone in her hand. So that kind of cancels out the argument that he felt threatened. Today, a state representative from Houston who chairs the House Committee on County Affairs also said he will hold a hearing on this before the legislative session ends, which is later this month. He said he will ask DPS and the Texas Attorney General to testify. Chris and Izzy. All right, and again, uh, the AG's office represented the state in this case. No one from that office has yet commented. Uh, the two presidential candidates, I think Teresa sort of touched on this from Texas, they both want the case reopened. Beto O'Rourke tweeted, there must be full accountability and justice. And Julian Castro tweeted, the recently released video Sandra Bland took of her own arrest provides the latest example of a police justification for the death of an unarmed black person being revealed as a flat out lie. We want to hear from you. Uh, should authorities reopen the Sandra Bland investigation? You can go to the Vote Now tab of the WFAA app, and we'll circle back in just a few minutes. Okay, Chris, thank you. We are keeping an eye on.